Good evening. I'm Brent Solomon. Mike and Ann have the night off. Just a little over two hours ago, Kevin Johnson was executed by lethal injection. Five on your side is Robert Townsend now with the very latest developments from the state prison in Bontair. After more than a two hour wait, Kevin Johnson was executed here at this state prison for the murder of Kirkwood Police Sergeant William McEntee 17 years ago. Bill was killed on his hands and knees in the front of strangers and people he dedicated his life to. For the first time since that tragic and heartbreaking day, Sergeant McEntee's widow spoke out during a brief news conference after the execution. Mary McEntee held back tears as she talked about the day Johnson ambushed, repeatedly shot and killed her husband, the father of her three kids, as he sat in his patrol car. The fallen police sergeant's widow and two loved ones witnessed the execution of 37-year-old Kevin Johnson. His children were devastated that, his, that their dad was murdered being 7, 10, and 13. They didn't have a chance to say goodbye. It took 17 years of grieving and pushing forward to get to this point today. This is something I hope no other family has to go through because you, you truly never forget or get over. Mary McEntee only read her statement and did not take any questions from reporters. Four of Kevin Johnson's family members witnessed his execution. In Bonterre, Robert Townsend, five on your side. And that execution was delayed as officials awaited a decision from the DOJ. In a statement, Governor Mike Parson said he hopes this will bring some closure to Sergeant McEntee's loved ones.